let's unpack a deceptively simple question. What will this print, var x interface equals nil, fmt.printnx equal nil? Most developers guess true, but the actual output is false. That's because in Go, an interface is internally represented by two components, a type and a value. When you assign nil to an interface variable like x, Go wraps that nil with type information. So while the value is nil, the interface still carries a non-nil type, making x itself non-nil. That's why the comparison x equals nil returns false. To have a truly nil interface in Go, you must declare it without assigning anything, just var x interface. In that case, both the type and value are nil, and x equals nil will evaluate to true. It's a classic Go trap that catches even seasoned developers, and it's a great reminder that understanding the internals of interfaces is key to writing bug-free Go code. If this helped clarify something tricky, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more advanced Go tips.